What's happening? What's happening? Shout out to those beginner investors and traders. You already know what it is. But if you don't, this is Goodbye Ray Valentine. I wanted to show you all what's going on right now because you may have a little understanding from a beginner to a beginner by showing you what's taking place with microvision at the moment and breaking down to my knowledge and understanding about the short ladder attacks uh as far as what's taking place with GME, AMC and other game uh, other other stocks and um you know uh right now you know as you can see uh when before I did this video about 2 minutes before I did this video 3 minutes before I did this video uh the volume of microvision was at 19 million it shot up to 22 million. That right there is showing us that we have buying pressure. We just don't know what type of buying pressure it is. Now, you can go to the indicators and you can look and see the inflow and outflow, but that doesn't necessarily mean, you know, that those numbers are accurate or that outflow or inflow is accurate because that, you know, we know and heard of short ladder attacks in these last, you know, few months or four months or something like that since J GME and AMC was stopped from that squeeze. So that's how you, to some degree, with my knowledge, understand the short ladder attacks. Because Microvision last week, we you, you if you remember about a week ago, week and a half ago, it went from about nine bucks, ten bucks, and it shot up to about what, like twenty three, twenty four bucks. So you know, uh, and 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 we all know Microvision is definitely a good stock. It definitely has you know some room to grow, and it's going to be a great company in the future from all the news that we've come across. And remember, I'm a beginner investor and trader, so you know, what I mean, do your own homework, do your own due diligence. But you know, there's a lot of things in store for Microvision. I mean, this from a lot, you know, a lot of professionals opinion, this could easily be a hundred dollar stock, you know, in the near future. So this is one of the ways that, you know, from my knowledge and and my beginner's knowledge, you know, as far as, you know, what they're saying, a short ladder attack is because we went. Like I said, from 19 million shot up to 22 million. As you can see, we had 23 million at this moment and the price in the, in the stock is being held down. You know, it's definitely being held down. And and that's just pretty much, you know, uh, I can't even I see I got to get on a computer. Like, but this right here, I'm not good at recording on the computer. This is the reason why I do it on my phone. So but um, yeah, man, this this micro vision is being uh, hit up right now. It's being attacked. As you can see, the volume is constantly going up. And it's it's a wall right there at that uh fifteen dollar fifteen eighty three mark you know what I mean uh, well it says uh fifteen seventy nine uh right now let's see if we can break through you know and I'm pretty sure it will you know because microvision like I said man it's being held down like every other stock at the moment and remember I'm a beginner myself beginner myself but man I do have common sense. <laughs> You know, we don't deal with a lot of data. We don't deal with a lot of technicals. Uh, yes, we understand them to a certain degree. But like I said, man, with all the manipulation going on, the best thing you can do is deal with uh, common sense, man. Have some, well, have some common sense and make sure you understand psychology to some degree. You know what I mean? So, And then a lot of people are jumping in probably on these call options. I I have, you know what I'm saying? Because I know that the moment that the squeeze could probably be, be taking place uh, again with microvision and could pop it back up. So um, because of all the puts that were put in, you know, last week or, the, you know, when it was coming down. So uh, we'll see, man. It's, it's almost on 24 million volume before the day out. It looks like we could go over 30, 35 million in volume. Uh, Cause it's still a few hours left, you know, before the market closes. So uh, that's pretty much what you know. Short ladder attacks that there are, to my knowledge, you know, this is how they keep the pre uh, the stock price down. They're basically, you know, hedge funds or these uh, uh, financial institutions. They sell each other the shares or the phantom shares or. 
uh, borrow shares or lended shares, whatever you want to say, however you want to put it, because like they try to figure out all different types of language to confuse you. And they basically just trade back and forth at a lower cost or a lower price. And, you know, that's what can manipulate the price and keep the stock down, you know, or they could possibly, uh, well, it's the same thing, flood the market, you know, back and forth with a certain amount of shares, buy them back and forth, buy them back and forth. And this way, you know, you cause volume, you cause pressure and bring the price down. That's just what I, you know, what I've come, you know, to some understanding. That's my understanding of it, you know, and that's, but, you know, however they're doing this manipulation, you know what I mean? I, I, at some point, you just get tired of trying to figure out, you know, how to explain, uh, a, a technical lie. It's a lie. You know, at the end of the day, they lie. You know, it's, un, it's, it's, it's unethical. You know, it's immoral. You know what I mean? It's just a bunch of shit, you know? So all this dirt that they sweeping under the rug. So at the end of the day, we know that these stocks are being manipulated. And in my opinion, it's happening so that they can keep on pumping stimulus into the market. You know what I mean? And you have a bunch of people that are not, you know, privy or have an understanding of what's about to take place with crypto though in this digital age and this quantum uh up these are quantum upgrades and how uh much of a difference is going to be in the future from the, it is now you know and we're we're not doing anything but fuel in the future at the moment you know right now it's about who's educating their self because if you take these uh like these PPP loans, these idle loans, you know, these grants and everything that their people are getting, if you're not smart enough or equipped to turn that into a business, you know, and make money and turn yourself into an entrepreneur, possibly, you know, find some way through that avenue for financial freedom. You know, this is another way investing. And a lot of people are not going to be a part of that one or two percent, three. Per, it might be a little bit higher. It might be five percent, you know, between three to five percent, because a lot of people are finding out about crypto and uh, investing. But there are still a lot of people that aren't into it at the moment. You know, crypto is still an infant. So. You know, it's just, you know, if you're getting in at the moment, man, it's just going to be, it's going to be crazy. So that's all I wanted to say. You know, I appreciate everybody for tuning in. They they attacking this out of microvision. As you can see, it's, as we've been talking, as I've been talking to y'all, it's already on about 25. It's about to jump on 25 million right now in volume. You know what I mean? So this is what's going on. And it looks like microvision is about to squeeze again. You know, it would look like we get, because if it get past this 583, We'll we'll be going up to about eighteen, nineteen bucks. We might go past twenty. Cause we is already up there. You know what I'm saying? So that's how I'm feeling. Let's get this bread. Let's get these bread sticks. You know what I mean? I'm trying to hog and die scoop the guy of the market over here, man. You know what I'm saying? I've been up since like five o'clock this morning. Four o'clock this morning. I've been up all night. I ain't really I only been asleep two three two hours. Shit. Now the Dogecoin was popping. I had to check that out. I had to hog and die scoop some of that. You know what I'm saying? I just been ether, Ethereum been pumping. You know what I mean? Right now is a good opportunity to scalp a couple thousand dollars here and there, and you know potentially catch some of those dips and get back on some of them rips. You know what I'm saying? That's all we gonna do. You know what I mean? Um, I'm gonna keep on, you know, keeping y'all posted with certain stuff, only to. You know, things that I with things that I like, you know, what I mean, I ain't going to get too deep. Remember, we dealing with uh psychology over here, man. You know, common sense, man. It's patterns to this, man. That's all you got to do is pay attention, man. And you'll see the patterns, man, is 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 you got to be blind damn near to not see that that's taking place. Look at this. I got I got Robin Hood on it, too. And, and the other portfolio. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. We got a little call. Let's see what happened. You know what I'm saying? Because if it could jump, why not? You know what I'm saying? And I sold when it got, I had 10 shares. <laughs> well, I had like 15 shares, but I've been profiting off of microvision back and forth. Like, it went up to, what, 20-something bucks? 
And I sold five, took a little hundred dollar profit, hundred and twenty dollar profit, something like that. And now it's back down. Now if we jump, if we drop back down, see that's why I buy shares as well. You know what I mean? So you know I can uh, definitely make sure that I'm going to make profit. You know, on a valuable stock like this. This is a valuable stock. You know what I mean? This will be doing this uh, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. So. I'm jumping on this call just to see what happened. If 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 I I'm hoping they can shoot up past sixteen seventeen today, cause I'll sell that joint, make a little bit, then jump back in. You know what I mean? But I'm gonna go ahead and start rambling, man. You know what I mean? Y'all know what it is. Goodbye, Ray Valentine. Y'all to pull it up to the block market. This is hood money investing. We're gonna get this paper. You know what I mean? We're gonna make it out here with the lock say. You know what I'm saying? Let's get this money. They out there panicking right now. I can feel it. They out there. They're panicking. Look at them. Now, you're not naive enough to think we're living in a democracy, are you, buddy? It's the free market. And you're part of it. Something just came across my desk, John. It is perhaps the best thing I've seen in the last six months. If you have 60 seconds, I'd like to share the idea with you. You got a minute? Got? After everything we've done for you. Oh, see, I made Lewis a bet here. See, Lewis bet me that we couldn't both get rich and put y'all in the poorhouse at the same time. He didn't think we could do it. I won. I lost. One dollar. Thank you, Lewis. After you. Certainly. <laughs>